Hello and welcome. I have personally witnessed the impact that depression and negative thoughts can have on someone's life. So, I have started this series of videos, as I believe that people need to be happier in their lives. And today we are going to discover how our brains can be changed, and how bad habits can be broken. Did you know that the way we react to the events and circumstances of life can have an enormous impact on our mental and even on our physical health? Scientists initially thought that brain damage from toxic thinking and bad habits was hopeless and untreatable. However, the latest research shows that our thoughts, whether they are negative or positive, are real. They are physical things that occupy a place in your brain. Scientists are finally beginning to see the brain as having renewable characteristics. It is no longer viewed as a machine that is hardwired early in life, unable to adapt, and wearing out with age. So, our brains can change, and you can change your brain by the way you manage your thoughts and your emotions. Every day, without being aware of it, through your thinking you are changing the structure of your brain either in a positive or in a negative way. Whether we focus on happiness, peace and good health, or on anxiety, worry and negativity, will have diametrically opposed effects on our brains. Either direction we choose to take will change the physical substance of our brains. So it is very important to redirect our thinking. Rewiring your brain, also called neuroplasticity, is an amazing process that forms new connections and pathways between the neurons in your brain. The brain is malleable and adaptable, changing moment by moment every day. This happens when you learn new skills. But it can also help you to change your habits and even to recover from injuries. The fact that the brain is plastic and can be changed by the mind gives tangible hope to everyone, no matter what the circumstance. Even if we are trapped in our bad habits, we can still be set free by making the right choices. It is sometimes easier to start thinking negatively than it is to remain positive, especially when challenging situations arise. However, this is the moment when we need to abandon those thoughts and intentionally redirect our thinking towards positivity to remain at peace and maintain control of the situation. What you need to do is to objectively observe your own thinking and reject any rogue thoughts that arise, and refocus on something different and more positive. Examples of rogue thoughts are, I can't do this, it's too hard. It has never worked before and I am not smart enough. Not catching those thoughts will lead to a potential spiral into confusion and varying levels of mental despair. A mind that is in a chaotic state, filled with uncaptured rogue thoughts of anxiety, worry and all manner of fear-related emotions, sends out the wrong signal right down to the level of the DNA. But, rejecting such thoughts stops their negative impact and rewires healthy new circuits into your brain. And, by repeating those right choices, we can wire out toxic patterns of thinking and replace them with healthy thoughts. But how does this happen? When we think positively and have hope, new thought networks grow, and this changes the structure of our brain in a positive direction. Those new neural connections are strengthened more and more, while the connections linked with negative thinking become weaker and weaker. This process will enable us to break away from toxic thinking and liberate ourselves from those bad habits. The creation of these new habits brings healing to our brain, mind, and physical body. You see, it all starts in the realm of the mind, with our ability to think and choose. Yes, it is with our mind that we choose to accept toxic thoughts, and we then spiral into mental and physical disarray. But it is also with our mind that we can change the physical reality of our brains to reflect our right choices. But to achieve this, we first need to recognize the impact of our thinking. Our thinking drives the choices we make, and these choices have ramifications right down to the ways in which the genes of our bodies express themselves. Directing our thinking to be more positive, making the right choices and watching for toxic thoughts, is the key to rewiring our brains. Do you want to balance your overthinking and overanalyzing mind? Reduce and control your stress levels? Do you want to get the chaos in your mind under control? Overcome and control depression and anxiety? Break free from addictions and toxic thoughts? Overcome learning issues? As you implement changes towards positivity, to reach freedom, peace, and success, it is important to recognize the following seven key points. Number one, your body is not in control of your mind. Your mind is in control of your body, 
and your mind is stronger than your body. Number two, you are not a victim of your biology. Number three, you cannot control the events and circumstances of life, but you can control your reaction to those events and circumstances. Number four, when you think, you build thoughts, and these become physical substances in your brain. Number five, toxic thinking and emotions lead to toxic choices and actions, which ultimately lead to the development of toxic habits. Positive thinking is based on healthy thoughts and leads to making the right choices. As we make the right choices repeatedly, these will form part of our character. Number six, as you observe your own thinking, you can decide to change it and to set the focus on positive things instead of negative ones. If you wire those toxic thoughts in, you can wire them out. You don't have to get stuck in bad habits. You can change those habits. Number seven, you can overcome the feelings of guilt, rejection, and hurt. You don't have to walk around in guilt and condemnation. You don't have to keep digging into the past to get free from it. Forgiving yourself and forgiving others is not the battle you think it is. You can be happy and filled with peace regardless of your circumstances. Do not worry about things that are out of your control, but step forward to change what you can reach as you make the decision to implement positivity in your thinking pattern. If you have nodded to any of the seven points above, it is time for you to be set free in your mind. We were created to have peak happiness, positive thinking, and good health. The first step you can make right now, if you have not made it already, is to go to bed early enough to be able to unwind and get enough sleep. Every morning when you wake up, new baby nerve cells have been born while you were asleep. So, this is crucially important as a first step. And waking up refreshed will give you a head start. Because it will increase your positivity, and your thoughts will have more clarity throughout the day. These new nerve cells are there at your disposal to be used in tearing down toxic thoughts and rebuilding healthy thoughts. The birth of these new baby nerve cells is called neurogenesis and it is crucial to allow this process to take place. Applying what you have discovered in this video will help you to go into the right direction and implement the right changes in your life. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel so that you can be notified when the next videos come out. If you would like me to make new videos on this topic, or if you have any questions or suggestions, please leave a comment below. Au revoir for now, but not goodbye.